Assalamu alaikum dear students and welcome to Pakistan School Muskat e-learning. I am your teacher Ms. Atasha Khan. Today our topic is air that is unit number 5. Let's have a look on the objectives. The student will be able to learn about air and the composition of air. My dear students, you might be wondering that what is air? Then you should know that air is everywhere, that is around us. Air is a mixture of many gases and dust particles that surround the earth all the time. Now, the second question is why do we need air? Think about it. Obviously, we need air to breathe. Common gases in the air are nitrogen and oxygen. By volume, nitrogen is 78% and oxygen is about 21%. Together, these two gases make 99% volume of the atmosphere. Small amount of other gases like carbon dioxide and water vapor are also present in the air. Not only this, air also contains germs, smoke and dust particles as well. Dear students, do you know that air is matter? What is matter? As we have learned in the previous unit that everything around us is matter. Matter has some volume and some weight or mass. So air also occupies space and air has also mass. In the first picture you can see the more the air balloon the bigger the balloon grows. Similarly air has some weight. In the second picture you can see the more the amount of air, the heavier the object is. Dear students, now have a look on the uses of air. All human beings need air to breathe. Not only human beings, also animals and plants. They breathe in the air. And secondly, we use air for filling the tires for drying clothes, for flying kites, and for making fire. Dear kids, uh, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope everything is clear. And I'll see you again with new topic. Till that time, take care. Allah Hafiz.